video is Soy Unchi Enferma. <coughs> Today's video is the first video to my series, Gata Mi Cuarto, question mark. All right, so I asked you guys on my Instagram story and I think on my Twitter, what should I call it? And I had my, my peers, my muses, everyone telling me that we could either call it cuarto because you can say cuarto, which could also mean money in Dominican slang, but it also means bedroom. So there's a little bit of confusion there. And then I was like, you know, should I say gaste, which is a little bit more proper way of saying, did I waste or I wasted? And I was like, you know what? Let's just keep it slang, but still like forward. So when you read it, you know what you're, you know what you're reading, whether you speak Dominican slang or not. So we're gonna just call it gaste mi cuarto. And it's gonna be a question mark, so cuarto. So, today's today's product that we are reviewing is the Fenty Beauty Collection. Wow, 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 wow. Like, I wish I could show you guys what's happening down here because it's really like, I'm really twerking. No, I can't twerk. But I am really excited to try out these products because I've heard nothing but amazing products. I've seen videos from all my girls, everybody, and I'm just like, ah, where the hell is my package? Where my package at though? Where my package at though? Run me my package. Where my package at though? Cause I bought the package when it came out, but nobody told me, or maybe they did tell me that the package was coming out of Sephora. I was under the assumption, you know like how everybody always has, you know, these these makeup lines and then they sell out in hours. So I was up like, oh my God, this thing. So I was up till 3 a.m. texting all my friends, y'all got your, y'all got your stuff. We gotta be the first ones to do it. I'm the last one to do it. So I hope you guys don't hate me. I'm here and I'm still gonna do the review for the Fenty collection because yo, gaste mi cuarto. No sabemos si lo gaste por buena o por mala. So I don't know if I spend my money, if it's gonna be worth it or if it isn't, but I really do have high expectations. She don't pay my bills, but Riri, you are my role model, girl. I love the way you carry yourself. You just don't give no F, son. Like, you are really what I aspire to be and I hope that other girls aspire to be too, but I'm really excited. Done rambling. So, like this video, hit that like button if you love this colorful background. I put this colorful background because I feel like poop and I figured if I put some color in my life, I'll make, I'll kind of see, I'll kind of look better on camera. And yeah, hopefully it makes your day to have a little bit of color in your life. And like this video for Auntie Riri. Like everybody loves Riri. Vamos a comenzar. Okay, so the hair is pushed back. Cabello está para atrás because yo no quiero any, distract, any distractions, okay? So, I'm so excited. We're gonna jump right in. First things first, the primer. El primador, la base ante la base. No sé cómo se llama, ustedes siempre me lo dicen. I forget, don't know how to say primer in Spanish. I am sorry. Let's go right in. We're starting off with this guy here. And this is the Fenty Beauty Pro Filter Soft Matte. Vamos a ver. Oh, this feels like a moisturizer. Ooh. You know, because Auntie Riri, she really cares about our skin. Like, if you think Rihanna, ustedes creen, cuando tú piensas Rihanna, tú piensas su piel, like her skin. Oh, oh. Ay, se me salió el aire. Wow. Okay. Can I use this as a moisturizer? Because it feels that good. You guys, that feels so good. Senorita, I feel for you. I hope I don't have any boogers that suck. So I bought two foundations. These right here. Compré. I bought the Pro Filters, the Soft Matte Longwear Foundation, and this is in shade 4, 450. And then this one's in shade 440. So we're just gonna do a quick swatch of 450. What I will say is, when I swatched these the other day, I went to the movie theaters, and I shower, I shower pretty thoroughly, and it, it did not come out in the shower. Like, my swatch was still there when I left, when I got out the shower, and I, like, I had to like really like rub it off my skin. So this is pretty matte. 450. Now let's try 440. Pretty good different like I can see the difference between the both. So I think I'm just gonna go in with 440 first because I feel like it might like oxidize. I'm just gonna go in. I'm going in and I'm gonna go in with a flat brush first and then I'm gonna go in with the beauty blender. 
let's go in fast because I feel like if I let this sit it's gonna dry first impressions is it full coverage it can be I feel like if I build it it could really work I still have un chin de manchitas ahí tú te ven por eso me gusta ir con una brocha primero y me, me gusta entrar a la piel con el producto y después Grab the mustache, Monica, because you clearly forgot to take out your mustache. So far, one coat? You better. Riri, you better work. Get wow, I just took off some of my brow. That's nice. So I still do see a little bit of me manchitas right here. So we go ahead 450. We'll go ahead solamente un poquito. I'm just gonna take a little bit and just kind of like almost use it like color correcting. Party poopers. Yeah. You see, like I need a little bit of yellow and red in my skin. Yeah, this foundation is bomb. What did, I feel like Rihanna took every foundation in Sephora and said, I like this one, I like this one, I don't like how this one does this one, so I wanted to kind of be like this one and a little bit of this one, and she just created her own mastermind. Like, wow. And I can tell the product is breathable. Cause I still see my pores, but I don't really see like, and like I just see my skin just looks like skin. I think that's what she wanted her skin to look like skin, foundations to look like skin. Me gusta, me gusta mucho. Okay. So yo compré, I bought, I bought the match trio thing. The matchstick trios and the one that was the darkest was the one that came in suede, caramelo, and cinnamon. But I also oh no no. Caramelo yo lo compré yo. Okay. So I bought the match trio stick and it came in espresso, suede, and cinnamon. But I wanted to go a little bit lighter on concealer and highlight because I realized like I feel like celebrities, the way we highlight, what we think is highlight is here, and what they think is highlight aquí abajo, which I think could be the same thing. But when it comes to concealer, Listen, uh, models minimal is too minimal for me. I need drag. Like, I want to see myself when I put concealer on and I look completely different. You know what I'm saying? I want to not sleep for 30 days and put concealer on and look like I've been sleeping. You know what I'm saying? So, I'm going to try to go with a little bit lighter. So, vamos para que ustedes vean los colores que yo cogí. De esto es suede. You see? Suede. And viene producto. Look at what I could do. Ustedes vieron eso? No se rompió. That wasn't shade. No, it wasn't. Shut up. No, it was not. I'm just saying. This was just saying. And it's a magnet. Pasa Santo Domingo y tengo algo que me puedo poner en el avión. Y no se me va a derritir porque aquí hay como seis luces. There's like six lights in here. And this is still good. Still good, okay? Moving on to suede. Wait, did I just do suede? No. Moving on to cinnamon. Ooh, that's pretty. Mira eso. Mira eso. Es como rosado. Wow, me gusta. Look. That's pretty. Ay, que lindo el shoe. E, my favorite part, espresso. You know, y'all know I'm a contour cold. Eso es oscuro. Tú me ves eso? That's gonna snatch the, the, the cheeks. I'm so excited and I just can't hide it. Okay, vamos a caramelo. So this is the one I bought outside of the trio and this is caramel. Because it just looks like it's gonna be a little bit lighter. So I'm gonna go in with the one that it originally came with. Y ese era suede, I think. All right. Y vamos a este color aquí para el highlight. Para la garnia. Jesus. So you see? Oh, this is actually pretty. But I feel like this is like close to my shade. This is so okay. Ahora con el beauty blender vamos a mover eso. 
Let's def let's uh blend it. Blending seamless, flawless. Look at that. Again, her makeup, I don't feel like it's supposed to look dragged out. It's supposed to make your skin look like skin. That's gorgeous. Do you see that, guys? It doesn't wash me out. I don't look gray after. If I want to give you an actual beat, 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 beat. Let's go in with caramel and see if it really enhances my bottom eye a little bit more. But, de verdad, como se defuminó? No hay complain. No hay complain, no hay complain. Me siento bien. Cate mi cuarto so far. No estoy brava. So, me gusta. You see that? You see your pores? That means the product is breathable. It's gonna move. It got the move. You see, I, I see, I see. Hello. <laughs> the first highlight's like that model highlight. I want the Monica Style Muse highlight, quote unquote, or concealer highlight. You know what I'm saying? And I don't have perfect skin. Like I have pores, I, ha I have, you know, discoloration. So, listen, these products is hitting. Let me see myself in another angle. That's me. Is it me? We are off to a really good start. So far, so great. Hello. Go to the How are you guys liking this so far? Does it look okay? Am I missing? Because you know when you're using a little compact, <coughs> you miss spots sometimes. But I feel like I'm okay so far. I feel like this product is definitely, these products has definitely been worth my coins. I'm about to have to rearrange my my go-to makeup and might have to put this one in the front so far but let me not get ahead of myself hold on el contorno vamos a espresso my favorite part of makeup is contour But I kind of like jacked it up already. Mira, que yo hice. I closed it wrong. But we're just gonna use it. I just got it just because I feel like having a little bit of a Fenty brush is like, you know, if you're a makeup porter, I feel like this is a product you could have. But I'm probably just gonna use what I usually use. So I'm just gonna go in and blend out the product. All right, so let's go in and blend out the faux hair. Or my personal favorite, my my Riri five head, okay? Cause I really feel like me and Riri are cousins. I'm gonna have to find out. Wow, this is beautiful. Do you see that nose? Do you see me nariz? Okay, I probably could use a different brush, but. Es para que ustedes vean que este producto es beautiful. Con el Beauty Blender. Take it all, Riri. ¿Qué tú quieres más? Do you want my wig? Do you want my drawers? What you want? I'm impressed. I really am impressed. Great. I'm going to go in and bake a little bit. This is how it looks like when I just applied a little bit of Sacha Buttercup. And I'm not baking, I'm just literally patting in the product to see how translucent powder affects the product. If it moves it, if it breaks it apart. Nope. Nope. It looks good. I got these two. I got the Mascar Mule and Ginger Binge, and then I also got Trophy Wife because let's just all be honest. You guys know I like a highlighter, but I'm not really like a highlighter person. I like the skin to look like skin. Talking about that, I'm gonna apply a little bit of Fix Plus spray to the face. I'm gonna go in with Mascar Mule first. Look at that. 
that's gorgeous and then let's do ginger binge which I feel like is almost like a blush so yeah these are both very gorgeous I am loving the way my makeup is looking right now on top of all this happening all this like awesomeness happening me encanta como se ve la cara que ustedes creen déjenme saber si ustedes creen que se está viendo natural el maquillaje yo no creo que me veo tan tú sabes dramática tan intensa se ve se ve como piel first I'm gonna do uh, ginger binge first I'm just gonna take this brush here para que ustedes can you see her Okay, I'm not mad at her. This is more up my alley. Like, I really just love to, she to show the cheekbones. Oh, yeah. Okay, then I'm going to go in with Mascot Mew, which is a little bit more glitter. That. Do you see that? Oh, that's beautiful. So, if you don't want the highlights to look too intense, I just go in with a beauty blender. And it just kind of creates it more like a skin dewy finish. So, coge el beauty blender. No lo moje otra vez, pero me gusta entrar a la piel para que no se vea tan intenso. Okay, I'm gonna go in next with Trophy Wife. Y lo voy a dejar así. Lo voy a dejar así. Yo no doy nada más. I'm going to leave it just like that. Let's go to the other side. Wow. Ginger who? I thought I could like mix the two and give you like a cute little, you know, number. Pero. She said no, girl. I'm, I need my own shine. Not too much. I think Trophy Wife is actually really gorgeous. I think I thought it was gonna be really intense, which it is, but I feel like she could work for me if I was trying to give you guys that kind of day. Nah, my thighs are. We're not gonna put her up here. Wow, Monica, ya tú lo dañaste. Look at what I just did. I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. I'm just gonna give you a little bit more because more is definitely better. See that? Huh? I'm sorry you was talking to me? Can you see? Are you guys okay over there? Can y'all actually like see? Cause this is really a moment. She showed me this trick that she does. She was like putting it all over my body. She would like put ginger binge. And she would just create kind of like this like body shimmer. Do you see that shoulder? If you want to come out with just one shoulder exposed, this is what you guys should do. Cause I know it's very often that you only have one shoulder out. Hold on, because I don't really feel like I'm getting into the shoulder. Okay. I also got the Universal Invisal Matte Blotting Powder. I'm obsessed with things like this because this really does make a difference when you're taking pictures. So I'm just going to go in and apply it right there. Okay. Do you guys see a difference on camera immediately? Because I'm sweating over here. It's a sweating party. And then I like to take a little bit and apply it under where I contour. So let me know if you guys are seeing a difference at all. Now, ahora vamos a terminar con los, los labios. So, let's do a little bit of gloss, all right? I mean, let's do a little bit of liner. Y después, con el gloss favorito, this looks so gorgeous. It's called Fenty Glow Gloss Balm. Whoa, that's a lot of producto. Look at all that. 
Oh, that smells like watermelon. That just smells like fruity. It smells really fruity. Oh, oh, apps. So freaking lovely. You guys, obsessed. Obsessed. Like, I'm trying to like look at myself in the, look at my skin. I'm absolutely obsessed with the product. I think the product was, I think the collection was thought out. It wasn't rushed. <coughs> Jesus, I need this cold to go away. I feel like this collection was not rushed. There was definitely thought and time and effort put into this entire collection from like just the packaging to the angles to the shapes to the way it's just it's just so elegant but like I feel like this is such she just set the bar so high for herself and for so many other makeup artists que yo no sé como like how I'm just so excited to see how much more how much this this collection this line is gonna grow and I hope you are watching this girl I'm your fan I aspire to meet you one day and just live for you because I really love how you just understand a woman I understand I love how you're just so honest you're so Kansas, I love how you always have the same circle of friends around you. I think that's something to really, you know, uh, take into consideration, especially if somebody of your caliber, you know, circles change and it's always good to have different people around. But I feel like her core is very, like, keeps her grounded. And that's something that I really live by. I keep my core grounded. And I can tell that by her collection, it was just her baby. And I can tell, I can really tell that this collection was something that she really wanted to take her time in. And I'm so proud of you and I'm so happy you did not disappoint. Seriously, I love this foundation on me. With that, like the coverage, the highlight. Riri, you better, you better work go riri go riri a hey, go riri go riri a hey. can we still dab yes we can absolutely we can still dab rihanna be dabbing all the time i think the collection i think personally got into cuarto okay so see si, see si, got in mi cuarto pero Estoy feliz que lo gaste. De verdad, I'm so happy that I bought this product, that I bought all these products. I definitely feel like they're gonna be, like I said, I'm gonna have to rearrange my makeup, my, you know, my must-haves up front, and I'm gonna have to put these right there, front and center, because these products are definitely a must-have for me. And I think this foundation is so, like, I don't even feel cakey. You saw how much makeup I put on my face? I do I look cakey, or am I just too in my own, my own horn? Like, I don't feel like I look cakey at all. The gloss isn't like, I mean, my man isn't kissing me, but this gloss, I mean, he shouldn't kiss me when I have gloss, period. Like, hello. That means I'm really trying to serve a look. You know what I'm saying? Pero de verdad, me encanta. Me encanta todo de este maquillaje. Déjenme saber si a ustedes les gustaron este, fi este look final. Eh, me perdonen, perdóname si ustedes creyeron que hice este video un chin tarde, pero estoy enferma, uno, y el producto llegó tarde. ¿Qué tú quieres que yo haga? Dime. Lo quiero a todos. Lo veo en el próximo video. I love you guys. I said, I hope you guys aren't mad that I did this video a tad bit late. But the products came in a little bit tardy. And I was also sick. I'm still sick. Pushing through to deliver to you this video. I had a fun filming this video for you guys. Make sure you give it a big thumbs up. Tweet me at Monica Style Muse. Y lo veo en el próximo video. Gata en su cuarto. Gata en su cuarto. Gata en su cuarto. Gata en mi cuarto. Can I get this in a song? I feel like we should have a Gatemi Cuarto song. <laughs>